Hey guys, George from Elite Rejects. This is my project. This is the introduction video of my system build in my 99 Dodge Ram. This is a port radio out because I bought a cheap Chinese piece of shit knockoff on eBay. Looks alright, but I don't I haven't even tried it yet. It has GPS and everything with it, so we'll see how good that does. I got the dash tour part and this is all the wiring I found. So if we did it did a hack job. So I'm gonna fix it. And then I want to, the, the dash bezel, as you see, it won't fit. So I'm going to have to fiberglass that in it. That's alright because I wanted to redo the dash anyways. Getting kind of plain. And he's updated. So the whole dash will be done, but that will be in another video. This is just an introduction video to the series of the build. But as you see, all this wire has to be cleaned up. And it's cold as hell outside, damn winter time. So it'll be a slow build. Plus, all my parts haven't got here yet. I'm putting a putting a Rockford Fosgate P312s in here. Two of them. It'll be mounted under the seat. And then I'll be putting a. Uh, I'm never tried them. The precision power, they're going in the doors. Six and nine. Each door have two. And we'll put them in the doors. So I have no clue if they're going to work good. I'm going to run a Rockford amp. If door speakers don't do good, I'm going to put a uh, Rockford's in them to do the whole system in Rockford. And I'll probably end up getting rid of that because that's probably a piece of shit. But hey, it was cheap and I was like, why not? It did have, it has the Kenwood in it, which uh, I'll be putting back in today just to have some tunes. But after this, I'll be mounting that in there. And when that probably sucks, I'll be putting an iPad, probably iPad mini in here. I'll fiberglass in the dash bezel, make everything look really good. And I'll be putting a, a, probably a Kenwood or something I'll mount in the glove box to be hidden but I'll still have it when I need it and then I'll just put a volume knob out here somewhere on the dash but we'll have a big center console here soon after I fiberglass scale this fixed on will come off of here and make a center console so I can get rid of this yes my truck Superman thing badass and after I do all that should be good to go what's the for niggling with the wires. I finally got this on. I just had the power remote going to it. I don't have no sound or anything. Which this thing's pretty cool. You can see it. I mean it's not the best, but one cool thing I sense you can do with it. So you get a factory setting and when you turn the key on, a lot of these don't have it. So when you turn the key on you can fix it so whatever you want to say. Mine says it's hard to do with one hand. Uh, Dodge, of course. It has all the symbols. Some of these I haven't even heard of. Must be foreign country. Again, Chinese stuff. Ain't got nothing against Chinese. They got some good food. But uh, it seems pretty cool. And one of the things I have not seen on touchscreens, of course, I've only had one other. And that was it. But they have games, video, like little games. I mean, they're not the best, but I can play puzzles and stuff. Which is kind of cool. Then I don't have the camera hooked up yet. And then you can do you know, the background, which is which the wallpaper. It, has, it comes with the SD card. It don't come with the GPS card, though. Of course, again, this is one of those 
not the best in the world ones. You can change it. So let's change that. So you change the background. Of course, I'll have like picture of my truck or you know some kind of symbol or something like that on it. So when you turn the key on, it shows Dodge, which that way it makes it kind of look factory. Of course, I haven't seen no 99s with touch screens in them anyways because the uh, this is hard to do. This right here is in the way, so I'll be taking this out and that, cutting it, mounting this in, and this and this will be gone. I'm going to actually just put this somewhere but in the dash so it's safe, and then I'll be running a uh, pipe up to these, so I'm putting circle vents over in here. So I'll be getting rid of that. That way I can move the, uh, the player up a little bit and probably put... I don't know, something else on the bottom of that. I thought about like turning those uh, sideways put there. Just different than everybody else's because all these have the same dash. You can't really do a lot to it. Of course, it's a 99. It's got the famous dash cracks. But I will be fixing all that because I'm going to redo the whole entire top dash. The bottom dash still stay the same, but the top will. So, just keep... Keep watching and make sure to subscribe and give us a like.